are trending with Trent, closing us out on this fabulous hump day. Thanks, Evie. You doing good? <laughs> I'm good. Thank I'm you good. for doing that, Tia. Thank you, you did a great for job. giving me that opportunity. And you know what? I forgot. I kind of yes. thought it was the other, or yeah, Tia the Tamara. USAA oh. insurance, but instead it was yeah. You I got know. To, your little movie star. I'm like, I just snuck right in he there. I'm like, uh, when Christine texted me this morning, I'm like, for sure I'm going to be talking about like thyroid pills or something. But <laughs> I, I got to talk to the one, the only sister sister. I gave him a good one. Thanks so much for weighing yeah. in at ATL and Co. You guys tweet us and you guys follow us on Instagram with the same handle. And you watch this clip of the love doctors, Christine and Chesley yesterday, which got really fiery. Okay. It got really spicy. And we heard from Ben though. And he said, we need love doctor segments every day, a podcast. <laughs> Good stuff, need all the more. Yes, but you know what? Meanie's got to be in it. We still need yes, the Meanie cam. Yes, very true. Regular podcast yes, contributor. Yes, because Meanie will just quite, and I wish the audience could see Mimi's face, floor director, because she'll just be like. <laughs> Stone cold when Chesley talks. Yes. Then she warms up when But Christine every now and then she will agree with Chesley, and yes. that always makes me second guess my, my thoughts. Well, okay, very true. In oh, those try very to, rare occasions. I try to be open-minded, but check it out on all of our social media. You For could, sure. We had some good ones yesterday. Yeah. One was about cheating, and the other one was about a, a guy wasn't, um, he, this mm. girl thought he wasn't that into her. Oh, and yes. she was wondering, was there something wrong That's with the him? He wasn't about, trying to yes, get seal the deal, to as she would second say. her base. Yeah. And we're like, simmer down. Talking about pure love, though, not that kind of, I know those are all in dilemmas, but Jim and Pam on The Office. Uh, yesterday, everyone, all those super fans of The Office, were celebrating their 10-year wedding anniversary of these super characters, these this incredible couple. Um, so I want to take a look, because did you watch, like, kind of the will they, won't they yes. early on? Oh, they, God, yeah. They didn't get married till season six. Yes. It was at Niagara Falls, and I want to take a look at that oh, God. sweet, loving episode. Oh, you're going to make me cry. So high up. those boat tickets the day I saw that YouTube video. I knew we'd need a backup plan. The boat was actually plan C, the church was plan B, and plan A was marrying her a long, long time ago. Okay, I want to cry. <laughs> I and know. Steve Carell is <laughs> their beloved boss. How sweet, I how love beloved. Them. And Aww. E News tweeted out a little factoid. It was going to be Roy. Remember, we know Jenna's Roy, ex, yes. uh, Pam's ex, was going to ride in on a horse. Thank God they didn't go that way. Oh God, yeah. yes. It was Thank a very sweet, Lord. sweet wedding. Yes. And also, Adidas just released a new horticulture, uh, horticulture line. Their new tennis shoe is for the gardener. In all of us. Oh, excuse me. Look at that. It's kind of a good looking it sneaker. It's cute. Um, and they have this guy, Alan Titchmarch, kind of the face of the campaign. He's actually a big horticulture expert out of England, ah. big gardening guru. Um, so they have him literally in all the ads. They should have chosen our very own Danny Watson. Oh, very, very true. I love Danny so much. Love He's that so man. Great. Home Depot forever. I know. Rihanna oh. is releasing a visual autobiography, okay? So it's going to be chock full of gorgeous pictures from her childhood to her fashion icon statements all throughout her career. It's available for pre order now and I want to see a little bit of Chicago Fire. It's going to be a crossover event. You're going to see Chicago Fire tonight at 8 oh, on 11 Alive. I was going in with that cutie pie. What's his name? That one oh, that was very cute. Yikes. But we're going to see a, one Chicago crossover where it's Fire, PD, and Med. Let's take a look. I love when they do that. And this is no outbreak. It's an act of terrorism. She grew in a hazard situation. It was arson. He wanted the lab to burn. He's covering his tracks. There's someone out there with weaponized bacteria. Oh, my God. He's been saying that there's going to be some sort of apocalyptic event in Chicago. That's Give one week from today, next week on Love Live. Okay, thank you, Trent. And go Braves. We're cheering you on. We love you. I'll see you right back here tomorrow. Bye, guys. At Lighthouse.